Okay, so continuing my WW2K slider discussion series. This is WW2K16. Hopefully you enjoyed my WW2K15 discussion. So here's uh, WW2K16. So let's go through, look at these sliders. A lot of it's the same here. It's like easy, normal, hard, difficult. Uh, difficulty, easy, normal, hard, and legend. Reversal limit. A lot of this is, hasn't changed. Reversal damage. A lot of things have never changed, so just going through these real quick. Entrance, on and off, weight detection, rope break. Army and playtime, they put that in there. It goes to it's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. It's weird they didn't have 60 was not available. It's interesting. Controller vibration, blood subtitles. So we'll do that. Checking that out. Just go through that quick. Uh, if you saw my 15, the, a lot of that's similar. Then the match. A lot of these are the same, too, for... Uh, Camera cuts, special effects, replay, targeting indicators, display counts. A lot of this stuff is still uh, available in 23. Help indicators, logo, target setting. This is all, uh, nothing's changed on these much. Just, uh, as I'm just running through these, just a look at uh, how the sliders have changed over the years. So this is, yeah, this uh, 15 and 16, these are pretty much the same. Finisher track, yeah, this is, uh, and this reversal. Stun recovery, was that in 15? I can't remember. I don't think that was there. I think they added stun for 16, I believe. Reversal recovery rate. So, yeah, these are all just, obvious. I mean, they're pretty, these are pretty self-explanatory. Um, lower recovery, less recovery rate, and then faster recovery rate. When you have a uh, reversal, stun recover. When you get stunned, you'd recover quicker, recover slower. Uh, stamina recovery. Yeah, it's pretty, this is pretty pretty obvious here. And the reversal is more. I mean, this is and says in the top high low. So these are all pretty self-explanatory. This this is a. Uh, just like just like yeah, just like, so I'm doing the series. It's just, just a. Go through and look, just look how the, the game has changed over the years. Then the entrance music, menu music, so these are all, I think later these are the same as 15 was. I don't think they changed any of that. When they went from 15 to 16. And then you go to uh, the rosters here. Just go to a, here, let's look at Andre. How they, uh, the attributes. Arm power, leg power, let's see, that, that's been consistent. See what they they changed momentum chain wrestling speed was that in fifteen? I'm trying to remember. Anyway, so these are uh, pretty. Uh, I mean, the the these are pretty much self-explanatory. If you had had less head durability, if you go to the, go uh, to the left, you go down and towards zero. If you go to the right, to a hundred, just more more durability. So if you it's better, just better defense. So I like the sliders on 2K23 better uh, than because they added so many. Yeah, down to one. I don't know why it doesn't go to zero, but it goes down to one. So you can you can. Uh, these are all pretty pretty escape. You'll you'll if you you'll escape more easily if you're at 100 and towards towards down to one, it's going to be harder. I think uh, I was trying to remember if uh, 15 had pin escape or not. I think they may have added that one. I could be wrong. But uh, yeah, these these are. Uh, Pretty similar to 16, and also um, with 16, they added. They also they have these these. Uh, this is as this has been the same. Well, I should I didn't talk about this in the 15 video. The the. Uh, this has been the same still in 23. The the uh, hit point ratio stuff. What I like to do is actually put. The arms and legs seem to get damaged slowest, so I like to put those all the way down to 600, and then I put the head and body they, uh, all the way as high as I can put them to 1,400 each. Because the arms and legs seem to take forever to damage, so I just yeah, end up, seems to balance it better. Just uh, my personal taste, and they get all the personality traits. I guess red, red, red is like bad guy traits, and blue is good guy traits, which is yeah, something they still use in 23. And then they got these skill things, which they they changed how they would do it in 23. But they yeah, this these these were consistent for a while. You go through all these, and if you want these, the apron DT, turn it on or off. These these all toggle. And the abilities, so you can go all through the abilities here. 
higher to level, like level one, two, three, higher to level, the more effective they are. I like the pin combo because they can go right into a pin, which they they basically uh, changed it in 23 where you can just hit the, the right stick to uh, get the pin combo to work. And, you're, and when you're in the middle of a move, they kind of change how they do things. But back then, they did it this way. So, all right, that's that's uh, all right, that'll be it for uh, my run through of WWE 2K16 sliders, and and uh, I'll do another one for 2K17. We'll just keep uh, keep going through these, just uh, something that does just be fun to do, just to run through all the how the how the the uh, game options have changed over the years. So, I'll, I'll uh, stay tuned for the WWE 2K16 uh, video in this series.